Hi uh, guys, it's Flay from Boxing Evolution TV and for those of you in the boxing world you won't need any introduction for the man stood next to me but for those of you that don't, I'm with Bradley Price. How are you doing Bradley? I'm good thanks, really good. Good stuff. Now this is your second outing on the Goodwin Boxing Show. You uh, fought Michael Lomax last time and you beat him. Um, your opponent this time, uh, what do you think of him? Um, to be fair, I've seen about 20 seconds on YouTube. Um, not that I disrespect him or whatever but I'm not a boxing fan, don't watch boxing. I mean so that's why I'm don't really study opponents. So that's a, uh, a bit of a, a strange, uh, uh, what's the word, combination there. You're not a boxing fan, but is it, you're more of a person that prefers to do the boxing rather than watch. Yeah, getting in and have a, I'll, fight any, I'll fight anyone, you know what I mean? But sit down watching it, studying it. Not for me, you know what I mean? I never sit down and watch boxing on a weekend. I mean, I'm just, just not a fan of boxing, to be fair, but you know what I, mean? I enjoy doing it. I mean, I, uh, there are a few coaches I know that say there's no point watching your opponent because it can make you start thinking about what he can do to you rather than about what you can do to them. And so it's probably more important that the coach watches your opponent rather than yourself. Yeah, what do you think about that? That's it. Uh, Jamie Arthur, he's studying um, Markham. So, you know what I mean, it's his job. He, he, he'll um, um, give, me, give me the tactics and we get him spot on. I mean, it's no good him watching my fights, you know what I mean, because he's going to be thinking he got an easy night work. You know what I mean? My, Last couple of fights have been terrible, but let me ask fighting on a day's notice. So plenty of notice now for this one, and it's going to be a win. Now, I know that you're a tough fighter. I mean, I watched uh, your fight against Patrick Mendy, and, uh, you know, you beat him, and he's a tough fighter. So I'm looking forward to seeing how this fight pans out. Um, as, a, as a Welsh fighter, do you have much trouble selling tickets or trying to get people to come up to London to watch you? And to be fair, no, I mean, I haven't had to sell tickets because, no, I mean, I'm getting like, a day's notice when you come and fight um, Frank Gavin. Will you fight Vabchenko? I mean, it's like on a less than a week's notice, and that's how all my fights go. So don't expect to sell tickets. But um, I suppose you're at that level now where you don't really have to do that. Yeah, well that's it. But uh, this time, um, the last time I, I bought a following was when I boxed you last against um, Michael Lomax, and this is the next time I'm bringing a following. And no, me, uh, that's a that's the pressure that I got. I no, me, I wanna I wanna give my followers a good a good show in of me at performing well. So um, it's a bit of pressure on me to perform well and that's why I'm not coming in. took this fight just to you know I mean just to lose on points. Took this fight to win and um, it's gonna be explosive. Well I mean I was I was getting to that. We we touched on it in the press conference, you know, people said are you on your way down now or are you trying to get another last stand and, and go for it again? Yeah it's it's I, I'm it's still a title in there for me, whether it's British Commonwealth, um but it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a light middle. You know I mean um I've took this fight, you know what I mean? But I'm confident that I can beat this guy, you know what I mean? Like I said, the 20 seconds I seen on YouTube, you know what I mean? It didn't frighten me, you know what I mean? I, I looked at it and I thought, you know what I mean? It's not going to be much of a problem. He's going to come forward, that's what I like. You know what I mean? It turned into a 10 round war, that's the word. Okay, well, I'm definitely looking forward to it. And just the last question I asked you in the uh, press conference about your hat, I really like your hat. You made me an offer, 20 quid, have we got a deal? Deal. Okay, yeah, next right. time you see me, I'll be wearing Bradley's hat. <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, Bradley, it's, it's Flay from Boxing Evolution TV. I run out.